Senior Report thanks Edmund Besch of Bristol Burgess Insurance Agency, 65 East Main Street, Westfield, for his generous grant to provide news to seniors. Funding is provided by a grant from New York State Senator Catherine M. Young, representing Western New York's 57th District with a local office in Olean. Funding is provided by a grant from Absolute Care of Westfield, committed to returning the favor to those who spent a lifetime caring for others. Absolute Care is located at 26 Cass Street in Westfield. Dave Cass and Rick Newell provide funding on behalf of the Lakeview Hotel and Restaurant at the docks located on Water Street near the lake in Mayville. Senior Report with Reed Powers thanks Westfield's Schultz Chevy for a generous grant to inform seniors of important news. Over 50 years of service to Westfield by Chevrolet, Schultz Chevy across from the school. The physicians of Jamestown Primary Care are happy to sponsor the Senior Report. From the Access Channel 5 television studio in Mayville, it's Senior Report with Reed Powers. Senior Report is broadcast live throughout northern Chautauqua County on Saturday morning from 9 to 10 a.m. each week. Call in and share a thought, make a comment, ask a question, or simply wish someone a happy birthday on Chautauqua County's only live call-in senior program. Since 1995, Reed has been bringing viewers hundreds of interesting guests, informing the community on a variety of subjects. Here's the host of the show, Reed Powers. And good morning! What a beautiful day it is here in Chautauqua County. Oh boy, it's, you know, it's just incredible what wonderful weather we have. It's cool. Last night it was in the low 60s. What a night to sleep. And today it'll be nice and warm and sunny all day tomorrow. What a, what a, what a trip. Guys, we have a lot of things happening around here. I hope you, uh, <laughs> TV is sad as hell today. I mean, this is a horror story in uh, Colorado where that crazy guy just went in. He was a graduate student too. He's working on a doctorate. And he just goes in and unloads. And he has this, uh, he has a, 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 a huge gun. It's like a, oh, um, AK-47. It's a big bullets and powerful. It has a hundred round ammunition drum on it. Now, oh, my God, he goes in and just starts shooting people. I guess uh, the, the recently they tell us 14 people died in that horror story. And uh, he uh, uh, he managed to hit at least wound at least 50 p over 50 people. It's just a terrible thing. And uh, once in a while, when somebody goes crazy, things like this happen. He threw gas in and everything. Well, you've all seen it. It's just a, a horror story. And of course, the demagogues like uh, the mayor of New York, that uh, Bloomberg, immediately announced we need gun control. Well, hell, there's some gun control up the kazoo out there. It's just a matter of any, any crook doesn't pay any attention to the gun control laws. Uh, so only crooks will have guns when you have gun control. Uh, they, they don't care. They can buy a gun down the corner, anywhere, they, they, all kinds of places. You and I can't because we have to follow the strict laws of the land, especially in New York State where it's, you have to literally give up an arm and a leg to, uh, to possess a handgun for protection. Every crook has a dozen of them, you know. That's the way those things work, friends. Um, on the good side of life, and I, 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 for the, uh, the, the politicians on the national level have stopped campaigning for a, for a short brief while to uh, memorize the, uh, memorialize, I should say, the people who were shot in this uh, terrible incident. Uh, I have a feeling that Batman movie isn't going to go very far. <laughs> <laughs> not that that's, it's not funny, but it's just a sadness. 
Okay, guys, um, on the good side, there's a huge antique show going on. It's, uh, I think, the 74th year they've had it in Westfield. They fill up a huge hall, Eason Hall, which is the village hall, and town hall, too. It's uh, uh, just filled with antiques, wonderful antiques, and they're uh, the very choice of the choice antiques. And it runs today. This is now, to remember, if you're watching this down the road, it's, it's on the 21st and the 22nd, Saturday and Sunday, this Saturday and next uh, tomorrow, uh, on uh, July, of course. And it goes 10 to 6, so you can go in there and all day long and come back the second day if you don't see enough. Uh, I see it every year, and it's just really fascinating. And I say uh, a kiss and a tip of the hat to the, the recent, uh, the late Priscilla Nixon, who did an awful lot of work on that and promoted it and continued it, and uh, to all the people that do the work on it. Okay, guys, let's get on to some fun stuff here. I've got the uh, senior, a little senior music, uh, senior music, yes, it is, uh, the senior clubs. And it's, uh, here's a note here that I've got from the Lakeshore Seniors. Uh, they meet at the uh, Dunkirk Senior Center. Beautiful center. If you haven't been over there, go over there. It's on 4th Street. You can't miss it. Um, Barb Barberich does the job over there at the Lakeshore crowd. And uh, the uh, God Bless America is always sung and the Pledge of Allegiance is always sung, almost universally, uh, with the uh, groups. Uh, Stella Michalak served the coffee and the cake, and yeah, it was just great. Uh, they have a nice meeting. Uh, the next, uh, next crowd will be uh, in, in August, and you know, they're having a, they have a, quite a nice bunch over there. Um, Forestville has a good bunch, too. They have a very active crowd, incidentally. Barb uh, Tower it was a guest speaker there recently, and she had talked about the Fingers of Hope. Now, this is a group of people who knit and, uh, and sew, and they make mittens and scarves, uh, lap robes, hats for several charities, including the Children's Hospital. They give them to the Brooks Memorial Hospital, Roswell, um, school children who need uh, any, anybody who really shows need, and uh, they do a special little thing. Uh, they just give to the community. It's, it's wonderful. If you want to join the organization, call Dorothy Merrill, 965-4873. They also need materials. If you have some wool lying around or, or attractive materials of any kind, call Dorothy Merrill, 965-4873, and they'll be very happy to pick them up because they can use them. The president of the Pioneer Club this year is Carol Pierce, and uh, I wanted to say happy birthday to Joan Bloom, and uh, also to Peg Hyden, and uh, let's see, Teresa Latshaw, how about that? They're going to Niagara Falls July 17th, as a lot of other people, are, and they'll visit the, take a ride on the Maid of the Mist. That's that little boat that travels around down in the, the bottom of the falls, and it's, it's fascinating. You have to wear a special uh, jacket, they give you coats because there's so much water coming out of it uh, for the mist, it's a real mist. They're going to the aquarium, too, and have lunch at the Red Coach Inn. How about that? Very, very inexpensive. Uh, if you're interested, call Angie Logan, 965-4150, 965-4150. They're doing their mystery trip August 13th. The day don't tell you where you're going to go, but you're going to have a choice of stuffed chicken breast or roast beef. <laughs> call Angie if you're interested. On September 24th, they're going to Here's to the... Uh, Divas and Dames show with Marcy Downey, and they will leave St. John Bosco Hall where they meet regularly, and again you will have dinner, and your choice will be stuffed chicken or prime rib. <laughs> and I think that's a good menu, isn't it? Everybody likes one or the other, unless you're a vegan or something. A vegan, excuse me. Uh, Forceville senior graduate Megan Thompson was recipient of the Pioneer Social, Pioneer Social Club Award. They give it out to one outstanding senior every June. They're having a club picnic at noon at the King Road Park. Forceville is very active these days. Bring a dish to pass, they'll be playing bingo, so bring some little gifts, okay? Uh, the senior picnic uh, they mention, which will be held at Midway, August 10th, rain or shine. And uh, if you want to uh, want to ride out there from Forceville, Meet at the Forestville Municipal Building at 8 a.m. and the bus leaves at 8.15. Don't miss it. 
Um, they're giving out a free gift certificate from Walmart instead of making a gift basket as a prize. <clears throat> and incidentally, let me give you a tip, guys. When you, when you get a gift certificate, you can get them all. There's, a, there's an outfit called Gift Jungle. Gift Jungle, like where the lions live in the jungle. And uh, you can catch, like I, I buy, whenever I shop at uh, uh, Kmart, I buy the gift certificates because you get 8% off. <laughs> Can't beat that. In other words, for a $100 certificate, you only pay 92 bucks. Hey, hey, hey. And the same goes on for an awful lot of different outfits. Some of them are up as much as 20%. Uh, Walmart, I picked up some recently for 1% off. Walmart's pretty cheesy about it. <laughs> Which is why I do more of my shopping at Kmart. <laughs> but uh, Gift Jungle, remember that, right? Uh, check it up on your computer, and if you want to... You want some heavy discounts on anything you buy, check it out. A lot of them, they have Kohl's in there. They have, oh, huge restaurants and all kinds of things. That's an aside. Co uh, food committee, for that means a coffee uh, for the September uh, show. Uh, Dorothy Schneider, Norma Stewart. Sure and happy seniors who have their own song. And they meet at Bosco, St. Bosco Hall. Ellen Suttle does the job there very subtly, I must say. <laughs> Uh, Reed, you're in a, a strange mood today. I guess it has to do with what's going on around us. Uh, they reminded you of the Maid of the Mist trip. Uh, several people will go. Uh, Red Coach Inn and Water th Authority is where they're going. Cost is not very much, considering you get a full dinner, a long trip, and you go all the way to Niagara Falls, spend the whole day out there, 70 bucks. And again, as they mentioned, chicken or roast beef. <laughs> They're having a hot dog picnic July uh, coming up at noon, and uh, oh, lots of great things going. Silver Creek, they have a, their own clubhouse on 20 and uh, 5, and uh, their uh, vice president, uh, Joan Siski, opened the meeting. You know, sometimes the president can't be there, so other people have to take over, you know? Uh, again, they mentioned the uh, mystery trip from St. Bo St. Bosco Hall. You join in, you know seniors going to each other's trips. Uh, United Seniors, Charles St. George, forever and ever and ever, the president there. And new members, Ethel, uh, let's see, Fred Gregory and uh, Patricia Bradley, new members. Hey, new members are important for your club, any club, any church, any group, <laughs> new members. Happy birthday over there, at United Seniors, Dorothy Rexford, Fred Summerton. Next luncheon uh, will be the picnic on August 13th at the Fredonia Beaver Club, which is where they often meet. Menu, let me give you the menu. Sausage, hot dogs, hamburgers, rolls, potato salad, baked beans, mixed toss salad, watermelon, coffee, and chilled fruit punch, and all you can drink. <laughs> uh, wait a minute, that's a, that's a misprint, <laughs> the all you can drink. But it's a good lunch, you can't beat it. And they always play bingo, you know, afterwards. I had a couple of notes here from Lilydale. Uh, they don't send me messages, they just appear in front of me. <laughs> uh, two special events uh, uh, presented by, uh, now I, uh, I'm not sure how, whether this is Colette, I think it's Colette Baron reed and Sandra Taylor are scheduled for Friday and Saturday, the week of July 30th in Lilydale. Uh, messages from Spirit, Love Never Dies. Uh, the two counselors and authors will present August 3rd from 7 to 10 in the auditorium. Many selected audience members will receive spiritual messages from Colette or Sandra. Uh, okay, they'll teach you how to unlock the doors to the energy realm, the roles within you, and uh, how, they can, how, the message, how the secrets of, and abundance of the universe can be increased and accessed effortlessly. <clears throat> Sandra is the best, a New York Times bestseller author of Quantum Success, Truth, Triumph, and Transformation, and Secrets of Attraction. So anyway, if you want to know more about this, uh, go on to her site, uh, hayhouseradio.com. All right, enough said. Got a lot of stuff here. We, we're going to have, uh, shortly, we'll be hearing from Marianne uh, Spanos, who is the, uh, uh, the only Greek guest we've ever had, incidentally, I believe. And uh, she... Uh, She's going to talk about senior affairs in Chautauqua County 